called Water Shield. Has a little red flower an inch Whoa. high when it's bloomed. And Whoa. as we're close here, you should be able to see the little red flower sticking up. Then we have a bigger heart shaped one. Um, <laughs> yeah, they're, they're more behind us, but we'll see some more as we get back here in this There's cove. a turtle. Um, so oh, that's a turtle right there. Is it swimming? Oh, right here. Yeah. Oh, very nice. Oh, yeah. He's got a name. He just swam under the water. He's already going, girl. Sorry. I was just about to ask if there were turtles up here because I couldn't remember. Uh, we have snapping turtles, red ear sliders, pan turtles, yellow belly sliders. So uh, we get a few species here. Um, the water lilies can grow up to 11 feet, so we're 11 feet or less. <laughs> so out in the middle there, it's was too deep for them. Um, but that bigger leafed one, if you guys look back, you can kind of see one. But like I said, we'll run into some more. That's called spatter docker bullhead lily, and it has a little yellow flower when it blooms. But it's only in a little ball. That's as big as it gets. It does not fully open. So what you see is what you get there. Um, they're a good food source for the deer. A lot of times we'll see deer actually down in the water, and they're eating the water lilies. And they're also a good food source for the beaver as well. So. And we'll get to see a beaver house. Yes, we have beaver here. Yay, I love beavers. <laughs>